It is a tradition for 44 years. The St. Mary's Polish Country Fair, it is back. It's a fun way to jumpstart the summer, hosting around 125,000 people taking the staycation route this holiday weekend. <laughs> 7 Action News reporter Mike Wolfolk joins us live from Orchard Lake with a preview of all the weekend's festivities. Good morning, Mike. Hey, good morning, guys. Interesting, Andy, that you said this is a great way to jumpstart the summer, and it feels like winter out here. I mean, it's mid we're approaching the end of May, and I'm still wearing a hat and a pea coat here. <laughs> Kevin Foy, yeah, you were talking about your jacket. You wanted to get rid of it, but I said, no, keep it on. You don't have to be gung-ho like that. This is a, a huge event you guys do every year. Biggest fundraiser for St. Mary's. Yes, it is, and thank you for being out here this morning. It is uh, the school's biggest fundraiser, and we have a little bit of something for everybody here at the St. Mary's Polish Country Fair. So we hope all your viewers will come out and join us over the weekend. We've got great bands that will be here to entertain you. We've got all different kinds of food, including authentic Polish cuisine. We've got some great desserts here that we can show you. We have a Vegas tent. We have a kid zone for young children. We've got the huge midways you can see behind us. Uh, so there really truly is something for everyone here at the St. Mary's Polish Country Fair. Now, uh, it's, it's uh, fairly affordable, I understand. Two, five bucks gets you in the gate, and then you just buy tickets to do the rides, correct? That is correct. It's $5 for an individual to come in, uh, $10 for family up to six, and parking on campus is free. And then uh, you can purchase an all-day ride pass as well. So it's a very affordable way to bring out your family and uh, just have a great time and, and start summer here because we know it's going to be warmer later today. Yeah, yes, it is going to warm up. Chris uh, assures us of that. And you can see some of the nice treats out here that you can enjoy. Talk a little bit about some of that. I recognize punchkis here. What, what else do we have? Well, we, we have a combination of authentic Polish desserts here as well as the standard American fare. But like you said, we've got the punchkis. We've got angel wings. We've got uh, Polish-style uh, type twist donut there. We've got your kolachkis. We've got your fritters. And then, again, some of the normal American-type cuisine. You can get uh, it all here. And you can get it all here. Whatever your tastes are. Okay, they're going to open the gates at 11 o'clock this morning. So you want to get on out here to Orchard Lake St. Mary's and enjoy all of the fun. Plus, you will be making a difference in the lives of uh, five to 600 young men who go to school here as well. We'll have more coming up for you in, in just a bit. For now, we're live at Orchard Lake St. Mary's. Mike Wolf, folks, 7 Action News. Back to you guys. All right, Mike, thank you very much. Hopefully, Mike can lose that hat there uh, when the weather gets warmer. <laughs> lose the hat and bring on the shades. Yes. Right? All right.